And now let's have the subtraction of integers. In order for you to understand subtraction, you need to master our rules in addition of integers. So I hope that you already mastered that rules. And of course, on how to add integers. Our rule in subtraction is change the sign of sub change the sign of the subtrahend and proceed to addition rules. Let's say number one, we have eight minus seven. This is our mean when and this is our subtrahend. Okay. So basically, elementary math, this is equal to 1, right? But if we're going to apply our rules in addition of integers and in subtraction of integers, this will become 8 minus, so we're going to change this, that will become positive, then change the sign of the subtrahend. This is positive 7, so it will become negative 7. And then, addition rule. They have unlike sign, so subtract the number. 8 minus 7, that is 1. Copy the sign of the bigger or greater absolute value. So this is 1, so positive 1. So they are the same, or we can remove the positive symbol because that is understood. Number two, nine minus negative one. So copy the min when, change the sign, then change the sign, proceed to addition. Copy the min when, change the sign, so become positive one, then proceed to addition. 9 plus 1, that is 10. Number 3. 5 minus negative 11. So copy 5. Change the sign that will become positive 11. Then proceed to addition. So this is 5 plus 11, 16. So this is equal to 16. This is equal to positive 10. Number 4, negative 8 minus negative 2. Copy the mean when, negative 8. Change the sign of negative 2, that, is, that will become positive 2, then proceed to addition. Unlike sign, negative 8 and positive 2. So, subtract 8 minus 2. That is 6. Then, greater absolute value. 8 is greater, so that is negative 6. So this is negative 6. Number 5. 12 minus 3. So we have 12, copy. Change the sign, minus, so it will become negative 3, then change to addition. So that is 12 minus 3, that is 9, greater absolute value is 12, so that is positive 9. Okay, and this is also 12 minus 3, elementary math, that is 9. If you can solve it mentally, or our rule is the same as, as our elementary math, then don't hesitate your answer. Don't hesitate about your answer, rather. Number six. 14, or negative 14 minus negative 15. So negative 14, change the sign, that will become positive 15, then proceed to addition. So, one negative and one positive, so that is 15 minus 14, positive 1. This is positive 1. So, in subtraction of integers, you need to have a plenty of exercises. 
you need to solve a lot of problems. But in order for you to master that, you need also to master the additional of integers. So that is directly proportional to each other. And of course, next lesson will be the multiplication and division. A little bit easy compared to subtraction of integers. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe in our channel, Senior Pablo TV.